How's it going y'all? Milo TCG here and today we're going to be reviewing the new V8 Merlot mat from Cal's of Orion Games. So let's get right into it. So we got this mat here. It's a very nice mat. Uh, looks great. I love the coloring. I like the, the black that's showing through. It gives it a nice brindle pattern on both sides. Um, for those of you who weren't aware, that is how the mat is supposed to look. It was advertised in the very first picture for the mat. So don't be surprised when you open up yours and it, you mistake it for maybe the uh, the black ink bleeding through that is just how it's supposed to look so let's get out get, let's get that out the way first uh second let's compare it to the v2 that i do have here so it's advertised as a classic mat which is uh, one of the reasons why i picked it up and we're just going to go over a few key differences here so the v2 fabric here uh it has the raised pattern on it the v8 does not it's uh imprinted in the mat you can't feel it it's, and it's it's just there uh, secondly, the edges are not stitched while on the V8s, I'm a little, a little sad that they did go with the stitch edgings. Um, but it is what it is. However, I'm not too happy with how it was pulled off here. You can see a lot of the white coming through on the mat and I don't think that was intentional. If it was, then that's just not good. <laughs> I don't know why they would go through with that. Um, secondly, and this may be a QC thing, I'm not sure if I have to send an email for this or something, but if you go from left to right, it is just fine. However, in some specific spots of this mat, if you go from right to left, it does look like the mat kind of cracks and it's just kind of bad because you can see the whiting through the mat and it's just not the greatest. Uh, for the pricing, it was like 76 bucks which is pretty, pretty for the course for a new Spellground mat. Uh, it's a lot cheaper if you didn't want to dish out the 300 bucks for a V3 Merlot mat. However, the, the small QC portions of this made this a bad buy for me personally. Um, if I can maybe switch it up for a mat that doesn't crack when I swipe across it, that'd be great. Um, it does happen in a few areas throughout the mat kind of like up here over here and I didn't really test the side over here a bunch we can go ahead and flip it over anyway and this side's fine it doesn't do that anywhere on this side so it might be a QC error uh actually it does a little bit off here to the right but that's if you go from left to right which is uh different from the other side so that's really all I got for this uh, honestly for the pricing it's not bad I do love the softness of the mat um, it's a little softer than the V7s in my opinion, but uh, that just could be a placebo effect thing. Other than that, great mat. However, I would like some of these QC issues handled um, for, you know, something that's uh, replicating a classic, which uh, a lot of the players do hold near and dear to their hearts. But yeah, if you got this mat and you had similar issues, let me know. And um, we'll see you in the next video. As always, like, subscribe. Bye.